Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Enemy Within with me, Get Daved. Alright, let's scan for activity here. We kind of have to be careful. Excavation complete. Commander, our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. Carry on. Situation room. And it terminated. That's pretty annoying. They gave us 20 days to fulfill it, so we could only get away with fulfilling their request if the satellite was already under construction. <sighs> well, that hurts. But had to go for it. Like we couldn't have bartered for an extra 10 minutes. Why would they give you 20 days? Why not 21? Incoming transmission. We are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations. And that is not a statement this council makes lightly. Yay. Remember, we will be watching. Okay, so now we have money. Time to spend it. Uh, thing one. It's really nice to get this one early. I mean, look, all of them are nice to get early, but... We're gonna have a ton of promotions going forward, and Will will factor in really importantly. So, I'm just gonna bite the bullet and go for it. Yeah. That is a long-term investment. In the short term, I don't really think it's Senior worth it. This morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Okay, way the heck over here. Hmm. I don't know if we need to worry about that quite yet, because our power levels are okay. I was kind of thinking um, I would set up a power facility here, but this might actually end up being a better place to go with my satellite uplinks and then build my power cluster way down in the corner. I mean, we have... yeah. It just would be a shame to get rid of, you know. Well, I don't have to decide at exactly this minute. Five power, ten engineers. So all our power would be eaten up if we uh, built things. Alien containment. And satellite dumplings going to get us more money. seen of their technology. If the aliens were intent on conquering Earth, there's not much we could do to stop them. I'm guessing they have something else in mind. Well, that's a horrifying thought. Thanks for bringing it up, Dr. Shen. Okay, it's been made cheaper. I think I'm going to go for it. That way we'll have two to launch right away. And money, 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 and counter panic. We'll have it, don't worry. Okay, hopefully people don't want cash. Commander, we've got another contact. Oh, crap. The signature is a little bigger this time, though. I don't know if we'll be able to take it down. Last time we used Raven 3, I think. I seriously believe we will fail to shoot this thing down. Two hits. Nice. 
one more hit. That was tense. Well, we did it. We won't succeed uh, on the next one, I don't think. Unless it's <laughs> the same size, I guess. But we even had pretty good luck there. Second support, I don't think we're going to need you right now. Not when we've got our sniper back on duty. And now he's got his, uh, his thing, which I'm very excited about. With scope, and with sniper rifle, and with squad sight, he could do great things. Let's try not to get a bullet put in his head. Okay, our heavy is injured, I think. I'd rather have two assault than, than three support. We could also possibly use this as an opportunity to get another uh, rookie experienced. Uh, it's a little tempting. Yeah, why not? Welcome to the team, Yvonne. Dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. Whoa, we're based out of Nigeria. Some pretty thick cores were sliding down there. Central, this is Big Sky. Strike one is ready to secure the craft. Copy, Big Sky. Strike one is clear to attempt the breach. Man. Looks pretty rough here. The UFO was shot down on top of a skyscraper. Looks like there it is. I kind of wish they would have like the Sky Ranger like up there with a spotlight, or even just throwing out some some glow sticks so we can see what's going on. This is a terrifying looking map. Well, that didn't take long. Oh, great, these guys. Okay, I'm not exactly sure how that guy's considered covered, but anyway. We might be able to get a decent shot from someone else. I'm on it, Commander. But not him. get in too deep. Fifty six I'll go for it. You plasma rifle, you'll note they have a slightly meaner sounding gun because it's uh, slightly more terrible. Okay, he looks pretty exposed actually. Fortune favors the bold! Also, I can wuss out and go with Overwatch. Alright, now 
He unfortunately does not have line of sight, and this is not a great map for such things. Oh man, line of sight on Meld over there. Roger that. Okay, we'll switch it. Maybe we can get a decent shot in. We did negative damage. Alright, Guzman. Probably gonna have to wait until later for your next kill. For your only kill coming up, I hope. Yeah, at that range. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Something very ant-like about that. Okay, I think if we get too wrapped up in the engagement over there, we will miss out our opportunity to go for that meld, so we're going to have to split up, unfortunately. Um, go get him, rookie. flanking possibility. This actually just became pretty intriguing. Moving on target location. I like this map, unfortunately, in the sense that it's interesting. Unfortunately, it is, uh, kind of got me in a fairly uh, difficult predicament here. Given off the vibe of being a two-parter as well. There now. Uh, okay. 48%, huh? Okay, there went his cover. Oh, he'd be kind of exposed there. He's got great range because of the support ability. Whoops. Five damage on the medic. I hope that's not going to be a problem. Oh, boy. Yeah, you had good luck, buddy. Until it ran out. Don't shoot the medic. Okay, I didn't... We just got a ping for the meld, but uh, that was it. Boy. That doesn't look like the sort of fire that'll explode on her. Rolling out. I'm gonna go for it, even though I'm a little concerned he'll get shot through that gap. Alright, looks good for next turn. Who do we have left? He's down. Look at us. And time to shoot up. Yes, that's him spraying himself, everybody. I'm gonna walk back into these vapors. Can 
conveniently, those are leading me to the next... Well, to both of them, actually. I don't know if we're going to be able to take great advantage of it. She's probably going to get over... No. I thought for sure that she was going to get hit by an overwatch attempt. Huh. Well, first things first, let's deal with the meld. Got the goods. Nice. Thank you, Squad Sight. Still not in the clear in the slightest. Stepping off. Boy. I don't think there's anything to be gained by sending him upstairs right now. Can I actually have him reload his gun here? What was that? You hear that? What a crap. Shotgun! Yeah. <laughs> Shotguns are pretty good at that kind of range. Unfortunately, that was our last lead as to where to look. There we go. Thanks, game. Very much a fear of the unknown as you uh, advance in these situations. I'm using Overwatch, but over things that could be out there. There's no evidence to think something's gonna shoot at me. Both Thin Man and uh, Astro Boy enemies. They can drop out of the sky out of nowhere. That's really lame. Okay, she's kind of off on her own. I'm going to try bringing her in with everybody else. Uh, I think this is going to be a two-parter. I'll see you in the next video. Anticlimactic ending. But I'm keeping the tension.